Hey guys, this is Miami Automobile Technical Services. Okay, this is Ford Ranger 2012. Ford Ranger 2.5 engine. We are about setting the timing. The car just burnt top cylinder. So we just changed the top gasket. So this is the top gasket that we just changed on the engine. So the car won't start anymore. So guys, um, I'll be using this to hold the camshaft setting behind. Then I have some timing tools that I'll be using also. Let's go. Okay guys, let's go this way. Ah. We have this two cut behind. This cut behind here and there on the camshaft. That is where I'll be installing this flat bar at the back. Okay. Turn, turn behind. Go. You turn back a little. Don't just jump back a little. No. Yeah. Go. Okay. Ah, okay. Leave this one. The other. No. Take it back. Take it back. Turn back again. No. Hold on. Though guys, I was the one that constructed this flat bar. I was the one that constructed this. So, as you can see, you can see this. Then we have this. Then we have the camshaft. Number one, like this. The inlet. Then we have the exhaust, like this both fixing each other uh, all right guys i have another thing to show you guys <clears throat> so after this is done though the uh, i have another timing tools here which will be coming down here So here, the piston is about to full, but it's not yet full yet. So let me turn this down. Okay, it's on the lock position right now. Turn the engine. So until when the engine hooked, so you have to turn the engine clockwise clockwise so it's full right now you can see the engine cannot turn again turn so guys let's go then we'll start installing our chain and every other things don't mind my office here i have a lot of truck moving you know honing anyhow i don't know if by the time they get to this area that is when they remember they have horn so let's go. This is Miami Automobile. So we'll be installing the chain. So number one piston and number four piston is up. Then number two and three are down in this position. So this is the fully alignment. I'm using Evoke timing tools on this. 
So let's go. So guys, we are about installing the chain rail. We are about installing the chain rail. This is the dumper, chain dumper. Then the chain rail. Okay guys, we just finished installing the chain rail and the chain dumper. So the next we'll be installing is the chain adjuster before we we'll lock the sprocket bolt. So guys, this is Ford 2.5, Ford Ranger 2012. Okay guys, this is the chain adjuster. So the chain adjuster will be installed first and foremost before installing, before tightening all this thing finally. Before tying the sprockets. So guys, watch how we set our timing. And Ford Ranger 2.0. 2.5 engine 2.3 this is how we go then I will later show you how we are gonna set the pulley the engine pulley let me show you guys something here uh, this is the timing tools for Range Rover Evoque so same same with Ford Ranger so the only difference there is this this is what we use in Ford Ranger uh, in, uh, in uh, uh, Range Rover Evoque this behind there instead of the straight bar so I have to construct that other one instead of me getting all that uh, timing tools for Ford Ranger so I, I got to construct this then I use this because everything is the same with Evoke, Range Rover Evoke. So guys, so this is Evoke camshaft timing hook here. Yeah? And then we have this for the pulley for the engine pulley you know the pulley has its timing also if not the engine will not start or shoot then we have this to help us lock the pulley this will hook on the key starter so it's all the same thing with evoke and uh, range uh, evoke range rover evoke and uh, ford ranger so these are the same thing 
Okay, guys, we just installed the this uh, what is it called the channel adjuster, and then we are about locking this. We are about locking the sprockets, the bow sprockets. So you need two people. You need two people to lock the sprockets. So guys, I'll be starting from the inlets. I'll be starting from the inlets. Okay, let's go like this. I need two people. So I'll be holding the exhaust. Let's go. Okay, guys. <clears throat> so, guys, this will be the part one of this video. I will come on with the part two. I will end the video here. I will come on with the part two when I when I install the uh, chunk cover. Then I will show you how to hook the key starter and every other thing. So, guys. If this is your first time watching my YouTube channel, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. This is my email to mobile. Subscribe to my video. Like my video, share my video. Please, if this video will favor you, please just click the subscribe button and give me a thumb high on my video. So thanks for watching.